Hello everybody out here on YouTube. This is Real Beautiful Beauty here today. I'm going to do a quick review. I know I always say quick and I just keep talking and uh, blabbing and blabbing. Okay, anyways, um, do a quick review today on two hair conditioners here. And um, I try to always uh, find, I, you know, in my stash and in my purchases and things I buy, I always try to find for my viewers items that are reasonably priced because, um, you know, I mean, I can promote very pricey items, which I do buy some expensive items, but I try to keep it on the down low, keep it low key, because I'd like to either recommend or not recommend to my viewers products that are affordable. Okay, so on to that. Now I'm going to be reviewing two hair conditioners here today. I bought this at Puritan's Pride online, and I heard a lot of rants and raves about this hair conditioner here. I mean, I read really good reviews, and it's by Organic Hair Care Doctor, Bioactive Hair Care Organic Royal Jelly Conditioner, Restoring Hair Therapy, Restoring, restruct Restructurizing, and Energizing. Rest restructuring, excuse me. Okay, so anyways, I had read a lot of information about this product before I bought it. Um, not because it's expensive, because I only paid $8 for it. It's $8 from Puritan's Pride Online. And I read a lot of really good reviews about this product. I used the entire bottle, as you can see here, a little bit left. It did nothing for my hair. It is not moisturizing in any form or fashion or any way possible. I have really thick, dry, wavy hair, which I have abused. Long, thick, wavy, dry hair, which I have abused. I have highlighted it. I have colored it. I have lightened it. I have darkened it. I have straightened it. I have done chlorine damage. I have done everything to it. Swim it to death. <laughs> okay. But anyways, I heard this is a really good product for dry hair from what I read. It is not. Use the whole bottle. Honestly, honestly say it sucks. My review of this product, if you have dry damaged overworked hair such as mine don't buy this product it sucks and um, the only good pro about it good perk about it is organic a uh, natural product it has uh, no parabens no sodium lauryl sulfate no artificial colors no phthalates and no harsh preservatives and it is a cruelty free product as you can see the leaping bunny there they do not test on animals which is great because I really prefer and favor using in life cruelty free products if at all possible now I can incorporate cruelty free products into every aspect of my life which I'd love to and I wish they were available to do so but it's just not possible but for the most part as often as I can I do buy cruelty free products and I really stress for you to uh, educate yourself on animal testing vivisection and other things like that and cruelty to animals it is horrific and if you would try to opt and look for alternatives and options in life to go cruelty free I would suggest it because I try to do that I'm, I would be a complete hypocrite if I say that is all I use because I don't but I strive to so anyhow this product here has roll jelly uh, pure honey uh, Panthenol, vitamin uh, B5, red clover extract, heather extract, aloe vera juice, shea butter, vitamin E, sunflower, seed oil, uh, lemon peel extract, cedarwood oil, geranium oil, um, and I don't know how to say this one, pachatool oil, which I, I use actually use that oil and it's a very good oil and very good herbal remedy especially in lotions and creams but I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly I'm not a herbalist but I do use uh, products that contain that patchatool, patchatouli oil I'm not sure bitter orange oil and cedarwood oil so anyways has some really great ingredients and uh, you know cruelty to animals does a test to animals it is a um, vegan product I see the V yeah but I don't recommend this so it's the organic um, hair care doctor bioactive hair care organic world jelly conditioner I'm sorry to tell you friends I can very reasonable price eight dollars a bottle cannot recommend it to you okay moving on now there's another uh, cruelty free product here it's hair conditioner and this is by um, earth science and I purchased this from swanson's.com and it's deep conditioning uh, resilient rich 
olive and avocado olive and avocado hair mask repair strengthens nourish hair inside and out okay now this product sucks I um, have used this three times so far let me tell you um, it really doesn't condition my hair all that much but more importantly I'd like to let you know it gave me a really horrific blood red rash on my neck okay so like anywhere my hair when I conditioned my hair in the shower and uh, saturated into my hair anywhere my hair would lay such as the back of my neck my hair would lay against my shoulders over my shoulders down my back anywhere that my hair touched my skin made contact with my skin that this product was on my hair what it turned cherry red beet red blood red and it was itchy I have no idea what kind of reaction that was I'm not sure what um, ingredient that this contains that would possibly um, make that happen I do not recommend it if you have sensitive skin normally my skin's not not that sensitive as particularly to conditioners I've never really had a bad reaction to hair conditioner in such a way but um, it lasted for about 25 30 minutes after I got out of the shower I rinsed my skin off really good and 25 30 minutes later it did diminish but it was similar to a niacin rash if anybody knows what that is out here if you have taken niacin and you have that real red breakout uh, similar to a niacin rash that is what it looked like okay so it was kind of scary for 25 30 minutes because you wondered if it was going to go away and it looked worse than it really it itched a little bit but it looked a lot worse than it was i mean it looked bad but it did go away however i'm not going to continue to use this product because i don't desire getting a breakout rash again this product is sulfate free no animal testing which is great um, as always and it's paraben free i'm not sure um quick look at the ingredients here I'm not sure what would really give me that reaction I'm not sure if it's the alcohol content I really don't believe that would be the alcohol content because uh, most every uh, product has the ingredient of alcohol in it so I really can't say it would be that um, I would think okay it's not panthenol because I've used that and never had a reaction to it it's not the avocado oil I've used that a lot no reaction reaction to that I have a Doberman Pinscher hair that's sticking here. There's a sticky spot on this, and there's a Doberman Pinscher hair stuck to it. <laughs> See those little short hairs in my videos? Uh, that's Doberman Pinscher hair. Okay, anyhow, um, let's see, coca, co cocos, coconut oil. It's not that. I'm not allergic to coconut oil. Olive oil, fine. I'm not allergic to that. Um, Hydrolyzed silk protein. I don't believe it's that. Usually never had a reaction to that. Um, glycerin but I really never get a reaction to that I don't think it's that potassium sorbate a preser natural preservative I really never get a um, reaction to that I, it, I guess it must be the fragrance perfume that they're using it's very lightly scented so I'm not sure I'm not sure I really don't know I don't know I really don't see anything um, under great scrutiny in that ingredient list that would give me a breakout but let me tell you, there is something in there. And if you have sensitive skin, I don't recommend using it. Normally, my skin's not that sensitive. But I tell you what, I get a really terrible skin reaction uh, from this. Really bad. I do not recommend the Earth Science Deep Conditioning Oil and Avocado Hair Mask. Can't, re can't recommend it to you. Reasonable price, $8 a tube. Got it from Swanson's. Just cannot recommend it. Got a really bad breakout rash. I will not be continuing um, on to use the rest of this. And there's a lot left, but I'm not going to use it. It's just a little too risky with a rash breakout. And I also don't recommend this. I hope you enjoy the video. Thanks a lot. Bye now.